Welcome to the Red Pill Media. Friday, October 21st, 2022. Here's why white people are now more likely to die from COVID than black folks. You know, a new report by the Washington Post examines the change in COVID-19 mortality that started in October 2021. From the beginning of the pandemic, the racial disparity between black and white folks dying from the coronavirus was substantial. Black people were more than three times as likely to die from COVID as their white counterparts. Black people were more likely to succumb to the disease because underlying health conditions like diabetes, high blood pressure, and obesity affect us earlier in life and at higher rates than white folks. However, the fall of 2021 marked the first time the gap reversed with black rates lower than white rates. In addition, the virus is more vicious with unvaccinated adults, which statistics show are more likely to be Republicans, which leads to higher rates of both infection and death. On the surface, the reason COVID death rates have flipped is because white conservatives choose not to be vaccinated and look at prevention methods such as wearing masks, as an impediment to personal freedom. This is true, but it turns out to be more complex than that. Data shows that more than 90% of COVID deaths occur in people 50 years and up, and white people are disproportionately older. More than 40% of white people are age 50 or older, but less than 30% of black people are in those older age groups. Hispanics are even younger, with less than 25% age 50 or older. But it's important to note, though black rates have been higher than white rates in the major coronavirus surges, especially with the Omicron variant. Mm -mm. It's important to note though, black rates have been higher than white rates in the major coronavirus surges especially with the Omicron variant. That's news for you. Thank you. This is the Red Pill Media.